Benny King, R&B legend dies at 76 R&B and soul singer Benny King, best known for the classic song Stand By Me, has died at the age of 76. King started his career in the late 1950s with the Drifters, singing hits including There Goes My Baby and Save the Last Dance for Me. After going solo, he hit the U.S. Top 5 with Stand By Me in 1961. It returned to the charts in the 1980s, including a three-week spell at number one in the U.K. following its use in the film of the same name and a TV advert. King's other hits included Spanish Harlem, Ahmad, Don't Play That Song You Like and Supernatural Thing, Party The Singer Died on Thursday, his publicist Phil Brown told BBC News. Fellow musician Garrett U.S. Bonds wrote on Facebook that King was one of the sweetest, gentlest and gifted souls that I have had the privilege of knowing and calling my friend for more than 50 years. He wrote, I can't tell you that Benny will be missed more than words can say. Our sincere condolences go out to Betty and the entire family. Thank you Benny for your friendship and the wonderful love to see you leave behind. BBC Radio to DJ Bob Harris said on Twitter, So sad to hear that Benny King has passed away. More than almost anyone, he fired and inspired my love of music. Number sign Stan Benny Number sign their poets Mike Bobby. Actor Jerry O'Connell, who played Vern in the film Stand By Me alongside River Phoenix and Corey Feldman, tweeted, You know you are good when John Lennon covers your song. Benny King was a wonderful and immensely talented man. Born Benjamin Earl Elson, he initially joined a duo group called The Five Crowns, who became the Drifters after that group's manager fired the band's previous members. He co-wrote and sang on the band's single There Goes My Baby, which reached number two in the U.S. in 1959. But the group members were paid just $100 per week by their manager and, after a request for a pay rise was turned down, the singer decided to go.